Good morning, you guys. Welcome back to my channel. Before we get into today's vlog, I wanted to thank Nike for sponsoring today's video. I'll talk more about them later. I am out running a couple errands. I have a few appointments today. Um, I'm at CVS right now. I had a dermatologist appointment last week to get back on Accutane. Unfortunately, if you've been following my skin journey, I've talked a lot about it on my vlogs and on my stories on Instagram, but I was on Accutane last year and I decided to pull myself off of it because my acne cleared up within the first couple days of taking the Accutane, which I know is not normal, but everything cleared up within the first week like completely and I never experienced a single breakout after that. And since it is such an intense medication, I decided to pull myself off of it without finishing the full recommended, I think it was like seven or eight months. So I did it for, I think four or five months. And then after month four or five, I took myself off of it. And my dermatologist did inform me that my acne could possibly come back if I don't finish the full recommended dose. But I didn't listen to her and she ended up being right, obviously. I should have listened to her. So if you get on Accutane, make sure you take the full dose because your acne will come back. Mine did. Um, I'm experiencing a lot of breakouts now. I, it started coming back like three or four weeks ago and every week it's just getting worse and worse. It's a lot like on my jawline right here, which I know is hormonal um, and it sucks so I went back to see her and see what she recommends and she does recommend that I get back on it and just finish the full dose this time so I have to wait because you have to sign into I pledge and it's a whole thing you have to get pregnancy tested and blood drawn which I'm gonna do today as well I have to get my blood work done you have to make sure that you're on two forms of birth control um, for the whole time that you're on Accutane to make sure that you don't get pregnant because it can cause serious birth defects. You guys know we are done having kids, so we're taking this very serious as well. Like there's no chance I'm gonna get pregnant. So there's just a lot of steps that you have to go through and you can't get on Accutane until 30 days from your first appointment where your doctor prescribes it. So in the meantime, she prescribed me two medications. That's why I'm here at CVS right now. I'm in the drive-thru to buy about to pick it up. Um, I forget the names of them, so I'll put them on the screen right here. But she said um, for the time being, for the 30 days until I get on Accutane, she recommends I take these oral medications for acne to try and get it under control. So that's what I'm doing here. I'm picking those two up. Hopefully they help she prescribed this last time um the one that starts with an s she prescribed it last time before i got on accutane and it didn't help um but maybe it'll help this time we'll see it's just until i can get on accutane which is probably not going to be until the beginning of september so that's what i'm doing right now picking up those two medications and then i'm going to go get my blood work done and then I have a dentist appointment later on this afternoon. <laughs> super fun, super fun stuff today. And then I need to go to Target. There's a couple things I need to pick up there. I could have just done a grocery delivery, but since I'm out running errands, I decided to just stop there. We need toothpaste, we need like random things, AAA batteries. And you guys know we do Walmart grocery delivery. But the one thing that Walmart does not have that I love or the kids love is um, the Applegate hot dogs. I wish Walmart had those because Grayson and Tatum love hot dogs. So do Bailey and Shay, but Grayson and Tatum love them. And I don't love the Frank's brand. The Applegate one is just so much better. So we're gonna pick up a few things from Target once um, I'm done with my errands today. Okay, I got one of the two medications. The minocycline, I don't know if I'm saying that right, is delayed, so I'll probably have to pick that up later. But I have to take one of these um, twice a day. This is the medication that she prescribed me initially last year, and I didn't notice a difference. But I know a lot of people do with acne. My camera battery died, which is really annoying, but I'm using my phone. But I know a lot of people that take this 
notice a big difference. So maybe it'll be different this time. We'll see. I am in the process of getting on Accutane. So I know that that's going to help. Um, but it doesn't hurt to try this. So we're going to take this uh, one tablet by mouth twice a day. And then hopefully the other medication will be ready sometime today or tomorrow. I just made an appointment for my labs. I went in to try and do a walk-in and they had nothing available within the next like couple hours. So I just made an appointment for after my dentist appointment to go get lab work done. So I just showed up to Target to pick up a few things. I need to get a new toothbrush head for my toothbrush. I need to get a water pick. I am the worst at flossing my teeth, you guys. And I feel like a water pick might help. So I'm gonna pick up one of those. Um, I told you guys we need hot dogs, AAA batteries, band-aids, and I think that's it. Oh, we need to get a present for Eva. Amanda's daughter, her birthday is this weekend. So I need to find something for her and I think that's it. So let's go in and see what we can find. Oh my gosh, they have all the fall decor out already. Eva is into all the same things Bailey is and Shay, so she said that she's really into sewing and wants to take a sewing class, so I got her this. I got Bailey this for her birthday or Christmas, I can't remember, and she loved it, but I just saw that they had this, so I'm gonna get her that for her birthday. I think she'll love that. How cute is this wrapping paper? They have cherries too. I think I'm gonna do the strawberries for Eva and this bow. Now I just need to find her a card. Okay, I got everything I needed from Target except the hot dogs, which is why I came here in the first place, but I realized they're just gonna get gross from the heat in the car because I have to go straight to my dentist appointment right now and I can't sit in the car for that long without the AC running. So, gonna have to come back and get them at another time, but I got everything else I needed. Okay, heading into my dentist appointment. I come to Modern Bite Dentistry. So if you guys need a good dentist, cannot recommend her enough. She's great with kids too. The girls just had their appointments last week, but today is my appointment for my cleaning. Okay, I just got here. The office is literally insane. It's so pretty, it has such a pretty view. I'm watching the Amber Heard Johnny Depp trial and they gave me an espresso shot with some cream and sugar and I'm ready to get my teeth cleaned. I have a weighted blanket and they have um, lavender in the diffuser too. Okay, I just finished up with my cleaning and now I'm at the gas station getting some gas and I was gonna get a snack and like a drink cause I haven't eaten yet today, but I just remembered that I have to fast for my blood work and my blood work is not until after I pick the girls up from school. I'm about to head to their school right now to wait in the carpool line. I'm probably gonna be in the carpool line for like 45 minutes. I'm obviously starving because I haven't eaten yet, which is horrible, but I didn't want to eat before my dentist appointment and have like disgusting teeth when they go to clean them. And then now I'm like, I can't eat now because I have to fast. And I don't even know if this is like too long to fast before my blood work, if it's even gonna work correctly. But now I can't eat for another like hour and a half until after my blood work's done. But I'm gonna go pick the girls up. Um, I usually try and get in the line like 45 minutes before they get out because the line tends to wrap around forever. So I'm going to head there, pick them up, and then race to my blood work appointment. I found an appointment that's not super close, like 30 minutes away, but I need to get that done. shirt because um the one that I was gonna wear is not wasn't too sleepy. 
Um, yeah, that's right. Two fingers. Okay, I'm gonna share all the pieces that I purchased for Bailey and Shay from Nike from their back to school collection. They're gonna give you guys a little fashion show and show you guys how everything fits. But if you guys need pieces for back to school, Nike has you covered. I have some of the cutest pieces right now and I kind of went ham on their website. So I'll show you guys everything that I purchased, like a flat lay so you guys can see up close. And then Bailey and Shay will show you what they look like on. Okay, here is a haul of everything I got the girls for back to school from Nike. And most of these pieces are from Nike's back to school collection. The girls had a really cute idea to show you what all these pieces look like on. So they're gonna give you a little fashion show and tell you their favorite thing about each item and how it fits. But everything is super cute, really comfortable. You can mix and match everything. And I will have everything linked down below with sizing as well. Love this set. So this is the Nike Sportswear Club Fleece Half Zip Top. And the Nike Sportswear Club French Terry Shorts. Such a fun color. Shay, what's your favorite thing about this outfit? Um, that it's um, pink and it's comfortable and I like it's for me. So it has a half zip top, so really easy to get on and off. The shorts have a drawstring. And let me see your shoes. So cute. The white pairs with everything. Okay, yeah, let's like see. That it's all Nike. So cute. Let's like, see your next outfit. Like, I'm a Nike fan. You are. You love Nike, huh? Okay, here they come in their second outfit. They're wearing the Nike training skirt and the Nike sportswear club fleece half zip top in black. So this is the same top that they were wearing, just in black. And they have the little training skirt with the built-in shorts. Can I see the shorts, honey? Underneath them? Built-in shorts. Let me see the little logo on the skirt. So cute. The same shoes. What's your favorite thing about this outfit? your favorite thing, Shay? I like the skirt and the logo, and I like that it's um, a color black, like darker. Because it goes with everything? So cute. One out of ten? Uh, 100 out of eight out of ten. Eight out of ten? Pretty good for Bailey. 100 out of 100? Okay. Okay, this next outfit was only available in Shay size, but this is the Nike Sportswear Club Fleece Full Zip Hoodie. So this one is a full zip. The other two were half zips, and then these are the Nike Little Kids shorts. So cute, they have the pink Nike logo. What's your favorite thing about this outfit? It's really, really comfy, and I like that it has this like fabric that's really Super soft on the inside, soft. fleece and lining. And it's in the jacket, and it's in the sleeves. It's inside the jacket, yeah. It's a fleece lining, so it's super soft. One out of 10. 10. 10? Is this your favorite outfit so far? Yeah, you look adorable. Okay, the girls are in the Nike Club Fleece joggers and the Nike Sportswear Club Fleece half zip long sleeve top. This color is so cute on you guys. What's your favorite thing about it, Bailey? My favorite thing about it is that it's soft. Let me see the logo on the pants. It says Nike on the side of the pants. So cute. What's your favorite thing, Shay? It's because it's soft in the inside, just like the other one I wear. And I like how it's really loose on my legs with the pockets. So adorable. Okay, how freaking precious was that? They look so cute in all the pieces that I picked for them. Everything will be linked down in the description box. Most of the stuff was from Nike's back to school collection. I just wanted to say thank you again to Nike for sponsoring today's video. finished picking the girls up from school and then I rushed over to Quest Diagnostics to get my blood drawn. Um, I made it just in time. I like, raced over here because they have like no appointments. Getting into this place is so hard and all the um, afternoon appointments are like hit and miss but there's no morning appointments obviously because you have to fast so no one wants to like fast all day. Like I freaking did willing, well, not willingly but I just didn't really have time to eat. I was just running a bunch of errands and like in the car. So anyways, got that done. So hopefully everything's good and I can get on Accutane within the next like 30 days or so. 
Um, but now I'm gonna go head over to In-N-Out because there's an In-N-Out in this area. We don't have one by our house, but we have one like a ways away. And since I'm in this area right now, I'm gonna go get an In-N-Out burger. I'm gonna get dinner for the whole family. I have to pick up Grayson on the way home. It's on the way. So since I'm in this area, I'm gonna go house down some In-N-Out, pick Grayson up, and then head home for the evening. Golden Arrow, my favorite. Golden Arches and the Golden Arrow, my two favorite fast food places. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Hi, how are you? Good, thanks, how are you? Good, thanks, what are you for you? Can I get a number one with no onions and a Dr. Pepper? Okay. Another number one with grilled onions okay. and a diet lemonade. Okay. And then two cheeseburgers with just spread. Okay. And then two additional fries. One additional fry? Two, please. Okay. And then two Neapolitan shakes. Okay. And that'll be it. Every time we go to In-N-Out and we get Grayson and Tatum hamburgers or cheeseburgers, they never touch it and it just goes left uneaten. So I didn't get them cheeseburgers. They'll probably have like chicken nuggets or a hot dog or something at home that I know they'll actually eat. Grayson does love the fries though, so I got him a fry. But Tatum is not an In-N-Out girly, which is like so bizarre to me because I'm obsessed. That's like all I ate when I was pregnant with her too. I came here all the time, like after all of my... Um, prenatal appointments with her there was an in and out by my doctor's office and I remember going there all the time so she had it a lot in the womb but she's not a fan of it yet outside the womb but we're working on it okay just devoured the in and out now let's go get Gracie boy and some french fries just pick Grayson up from school your favorite can you say thank you mama can you say thank you mama Hey, mama. You're welcome, bud. You ready to go home? Mm -hmm. Say, let's go. Let's go. Let's go, mama. Let's go, mama. Okay, guys, I think that's going to be it for today's video. It's a lot later now. I planned on filming our nighttime routine with the kids, but it was just chaos when we got home. <laughs> So I'm going to end the vlog here. Thanks for running errands with me. I hope you guys enjoyed the back to school clothing haul from Nike. Make sure you check out all of their pieces. Everything will be linked down below. Thank you again to Nike for sponsoring today's video. Such a dream brand to work with. Please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.